So uh, what can a 500-page ruling do against a powerful country like China? You cannot compare this because paper is paper, but uh, the, 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 the contents of the paper is important. So what uh, can the contents of this paper uh, do against a powerful country like China? I think it's uh, people in China, like we or like people in Europe or in America, they have to stick to the principles of international law. Those principles are simple. Every state is equal. And every state has equal rights. There are no privileged states anymore. There are five superpowers or five permanent members of Security Council. They have additional obligations. They are responsible for peace and security of, of mankind, the whole world. But they have no other privileges. Of course, uh, from political point of view, the big powers try to influence others because of the military mind, economic mind, population mind. But this is only a question of their own vision of themselves. But in law, everybody is equal, like in in, in say internal system, there are no citizens which are having more privileges than others. In one state, they have the same privileges, same obligations. And also, I think it's uh, in interest also for China to uh, be accepted as a good neighbor and also to have good trade with, neighbor, with neighbors. And it's, of course, better to use of resources not to arm themselves, but to modernize itself, to develop itself, to have more trade with neighbors than to have more guns against neighbors. And I think uh, the might is a fact of life, but wisdom should prevail over the over the short-run interests. The wisdom is to have better friends, otherwise you have a law of jungle. So this is something which I cannot accept. You know? And the world has to be uh, say, governed by the principles which the, we invented international law. Not for having a good written codes, but for the basis for cooperation, not for fighting. And I think everybody has to forget about own interests only, but to look what the other neighbors, friends have to expect from us. Is there a danger for a country that does not follow international law to become uh, considered an international outlaw or outcast? Of course, uh, one has to be very careful about uh, expectations. It's better to know before what is going to happen. But uh, I think from the long run, if you look into the world of today, there was no you know, say, world war anymore. For 400 years, you had two big wars. I survived the Second World War, and it was not easy. I still have to remember that we had to run to avoid bombings. We had to run to avoid to be killed by attacking forces. I don't like to repeat it anymore. Uh, I chose this profession to be a diplomat for more than 50 years. I served in seven countries or six countries. I was four-time ambassador. I negotiated a lot of treaties, and uh, now I ha I work for second term in the in the tribunal because I think the only way is not to use arms, but to use persuasion, to help each other, to cooperate with each other. This is the way to develop 
humanity to develop the world. If I compare the world after the Second World War with today, there is completely different. The different kind of uh, society, different kind of level of life, and different perspectives. We have to travel now to the cosmos to find colonies there. But, but we have to, first of all, to make order in our own globe. I find that point very interesting because our president, President Duterte, keeps on saying that if we assert the ruling, we would be courting a war with China. Uh, and you're saying the opposite. If we uphold international law, we would be avoiding war. No, we, international law is not against anyone. International law is for everyone. You cannot say that uh, the rules which you expect, you, can, you cannot uh, select international law. You have to accept it all. You can say, this is good for me, so I accept it. This is wrong for me, I don't accept it. You, you have to have, but one time this law is against you, but next time is in your favor. So you have to balance this. And, uh, also, international is, is uh, created by China too, and practice too. We have to expect this practice, mm -hmm. yes, but we cannot. Ex no one has to be very careful to to act, not to uh, break international law. Mm -hmm.